Understanding Ocean Reef. Hello language enthusiasts. Today, we'll be diving deep into the English language to uncover the meaning of the phrases ocean and reef. By the end of this video, you'll have a clear understanding of these terms and how they connect to our natural world. Let's start by understanding each word separately. Ocean. An ocean is a vast body of salt water that covers more than two-thirds of Earth's surface. It's larger than a sea and is one of the major divisions of the world's waters. Think of the Pacific Ocean or the Atlantic Ocean, these massive bodies of water that separate continents. Reef. A reef is a chain or ridge of rocks, sand, or coral that rises to or near the surface of a body of water. They can be found in oceans and seas and play a crucial role in marine ecosystems. Corals, which are living organisms, often form these structures, providing habitat for many marine species. When you hear the term, ocean reef, it typically refers to a reef located in an ocean as opposed to other bodies of water like seas or lagoons. These are often larger and are essential habitats for marine biodiversity. They also play a significant role in supporting fish populations, which humans rely on for food. Ocean reefs, especially coral reefs, are often called the rainforests of the sea. Here's why. 1. Biodiversity. They house a diverse range of marine species, providing food, shelter, and breeding grounds. 2. Protection. Reefs act as natural barriers, reducing wave impacts and preventing erosion on coastlines. 3. Economy. Many local economies, especially in tropical regions, depend on reefs for tourism and fishing. Unfortunately, these reefs face threats from climate change, pollution, and overfishing. It's essential to understand and protect them for the health of our planet and future generations. There you have it. Now you not only know the meanings of ocean and reef, but also how the phrase ocean reef relates to the vast and beautiful marine world. Let's continue our journey in understanding the English language and its connection to the environment around us. Remember, every word has a story, and today, we've just explored one. Hope you found this video enlightening.